Red Bull's Secret Money-Making Strategy In the world of energy drinks, one brand stands out above the rest, Red Bull. It's become synonymous with adrenaline, excitement, and pushing the limits. But behind the scenes, there's more to Red Bull than meets the eye. Join us as we delve into the secretive world of Red Bull's money-making strategy. Over the past three decades, Red Bull has undergone a remarkable transformation, evolving from an obscure, exotic, and somewhat peculiar energy drink into one of the most formidable and influential brands globally. With an estimated worth of around $17.4 billion, Red Bull has established itself as a powerhouse, boasting a plethora of professional sports teams, spanning diverse disciplines from Formula One racing to NASCAR, sailing to soccer, and surfing to skateboarding. Additionally, Red Bull has solidified its presence in the extreme sports industry by organizing and sponsoring events like the Red Bull Air Race, cliff diving competitions, and mountain biking championships, placing itself squarely at the epicenter of adrenaline pumping activities. However, what truly sets Red Bull apart is not just its impressive financial standing or its association with extreme sports, but rather its unconventional and highly effective marketing strategies. Red Bull has mastered the art of marketing in a way that doesn't seem like marketing at all. Through ingenious advertising campaigns and brand partnerships, Red Bull has created a globally beloved brand that has left an indelible mark on our culture. Remarkably, despite selling nearly 10 billion cans of Red Bull annually, the brand seldom directly mentions the drink and its marketing efforts. To unravel the mystery behind Red Bull's success and glean valuable lessons applicable to any business adventure, we must delve into three key aspects. How they achieved their success, their secret recipe for business triumph, and the intriguing tale of Red Bull's notorious slogan, Red Bull gives you wings. The journey of Red Bull traces back to the visionary Austrian entrepreneur Dietrich Mateschitz, who drew inspiration from a Thai energy drink called Kratting Dang during a trip to Thailand. This served as the catalyst for the creation of Red Bull, which was officially launched in Austria on April 1, 1987, marking the birth of a new product category, caffeinated energy drinks. Despite facing initial hurdles, including unfavorable taste reviews and limited financial resources, Red Bull persevered through its early years by employing unorthodox marketing tactics and guerrilla marketing strategies. From organizing events like the Red Bull Flugtag, where participants built and flew homemade flying machines, to utilizing guerrilla marketing techniques such as filling London's garbage cans with empty Red Bull cans to create the illusion of popularity, Red Bull captured the attention of its target audience and carved out a niche for itself in the market. As Red Bull's success continued to soar, the brand honed its focus on constant marketing, recognizing the importance of creating high-quality, shareable content tailored to its audience. By cultivating a deep understanding of their target demographic, primarily males age 18 to 35 interested in extreme sports, Red Bull curated experiences and moments that resonated with their audience, fostering brand loyalty and engagement. Crucially, Red Bull's branding strategy emphasized brand recognition and visibility, ensuring that the iconic Red Bull logo became synonymous with excitement and adventure. While the brand's advertising efforts rarely featured the drink itself, the omnipresence of the Red Bull logo at events and in popular culture solidified its status as a lifestyle brand. However, amidst Red Bull's meteoric rise to success, the brand encountered a peculiar challenge in the form of a class action lawsuit, questioning the veracity of its infamous slogan, Red Bull gives you wings. Despite settling the lawsuit for $13 million, the incident served as a testament to Red Bull's boundary-pushing marketing tactics and its ability to captivate consumers' imaginations. In conclusion, Red Bull's ascent from obscurity to ubiquity offers invaluable lessons for businesses aspiring to make their mark in any industry. By maintaining a laser focus on its core product, mastering content marketing, prioritizing brand recognition, and embracing unconventional marketing strategies, Red Bull has not only revolutionized the energy drink market, but has also reshaped the landscape of modern marketing. Aspiring entrepreneurs and business owners would do well to heed Red Bull's example and embrace creativity, innovation, and boldness in their pursuit of success. However, in the 1980s, Dietrich Matisic, the Austrian entrepreneur, stumbled upon the Thai energy drink Kratting Daing during a business trip to Thailand. Intrigued by its purported ability to alleviate jet lag and enhance energy levels, Dietrich recognized a unique opportunity to introduce a similar product to the Western market. Founded in Austria in 1984, Red Bull emerged as a pioneering force in the burgeoning energy drink industry. 
However, Metaschitz envisioned Red Bull not merely as a beverage, but as a lifestyle brand capable of transcending traditional marketing paradigms. He understood that Red Bull's appeal extended beyond its functional benefits of boosting physical and mental performance. It represented a symbol of vitality, adventure, and unbridled energy. Drawing inspiration from Krating Daing's success in Thailand, Dietrich collaborated with Thai businessman Shaleo Uvidia to adapt and redefine the formula for Western tastes. Through meticulous research and development, they crafted a unique concoction comprising caffeine, taurine, B vitamins, and other energy-boosting ingredients, culminating in the creation of Red Bull as we know it today. On April 1, 1987, Red Bull made its official debut in Austria, marking the inception of a cultural phenomenon. Despite initial skepticism and resistance from established beverage companies, Red Bull's distinctive branding, sleek packaging, and unconventional marketing strategies captured the imagination of consumers worldwide. Mataschitz's vision for Red Bull extended beyond the confines of traditional advertising. He recognized the power of experimental marketing and brand storytelling and forging emotional connections with consumers. Thus, Red Bull embarked on a journey to redefine the boundaries of marketing, pioneering innovative initiatives such as the Red Bull Flugtag, where participants constructed homemade flying machines and soared off makeshift ramps into bodies of water, captivating audiences with their audacious feats of creativity and ingenuity. As Red Bull's popularity surged, fueled by word-of-mouth endorsements and viral marketing campaigns, the brand transcended its identity as a mere energy drink and evolved into a cultural phenomenon synonymous with adventure, adrenaline, and limitless possibilities. From sponsoring extreme sports events to hosting adrenaline-fueled competitions, Red Bull became an integral part of the global zeitgeist, inspiring as generation of thrill-seekers and adrenaline junkies. In essence, Red Bull's history is a testament to the power of vision, innovation, and relentless perseverance in the face of adversity. What began as a humble beverage aimed at boosting energy levels has blossomed into a multi-billion dollar empire, reshaping the landscape of the beverage industry and leaving an indelible mark on popular culture. As Red Bull continues to push the boundaries of marketing and redefine the notion of brand engagement, its legacy serves as a beacon of inspiration for entrepreneurs and marketers alike, reminding us that with creativity, passion, and a bold vision, anything is possible. From transforming city buses into giant Red Bull cans to hosting impromptu street races, Red Bull knows how to capture attention and create memorable experiences for its consumers. Red Bull's partnerships with athletes, musicians, and artists further solidify its status as a lifestyle brand. By aligning with influencers and trendsetters, Red Bull stays at the forefront of cultural relevance. In addition to its flagship energy drink, Red Bull has expanded its product line to include variations like Red Bull Sugar Free, Red Bull Zero Calories, and even Red Bull Additions with unique flavors. This diversification ensures that Red Bull remains accessible to a wide range of consumers. As we've seen, Red Bull's success is no accident. Through strategic marketing, brand partnerships, and a relentless focus on innovation, Red Bull has carved out a unique niche in the beverage industry. And while their secret money-making strategy may remain hidden to some, one thing is clear. Red Bull shows no signs of slowing down. Hey, thanks for joining us on this journey into the world of Red Bull. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.